Hello, this is Miles, and welcome back to another episode from Global Social Media Marketing. Have you heard the exciting news? High Level has just introduced a groundbreaking feature called WordPress Hosting, allowing you to host your website directly on the High Level platform, eliminating the need for external hosting providers. But what if you already have a website hosted elsewhere? No worries, you can seamlessly migrate your existing WordPress site to High Level in just a few minutes. In this video, I'll guide you through the simple steps to migrate your website to High Level. So let's get started. Our first step is to purchase hosting from the High Level platform. It's a straightforward process. Let me show you how it's done. Navigate to the account for which you want to purchase hosting. For this example, we'll use the account Global Social Media Marketing. However, I'll also demonstrate how to do this for an account without hosting. To purchase hosting, go to the side section from the left navigation panel and click on WordPress. Once you've purchased hosting from the high-level platform, you can proceed to the next step by clicking on the screen button to get started. Click on it and you can fill in your details, credit card details and purchase the hosting from the high-level platform. Once you have purchased the hosting provider, the next step is to go to sites and then go to the site section from the left panel. From there, again, go to WordPress, and if you have purchased the hosting, this page will now turn to this feature, and from here, you can create your WordPress site. So just click on this Create a button, and here you can fill in the details for your website for which you want to migrate. We are going to migrate this one website, which is called Roofing Marketing Company. So I will replace this name, and you can generate the WordPress admin password. And once you have filled in these details, you can click on Create a WordPress site, it will take a few seconds to create a website for you. It will give you instant access to the WordPress URL, and this is the admin access. The next step is to add the domain for this website, which you have already added. You can add just this domain that you want to migrate and click on Add Domain. After adding the domains, you'll receive three records, two TXD records and one A record. To proceed, log into your domain provider, the place where you purchased your domain. Customize the DNS settings of your domain provider by adding these records to your domain name's DNS settings. This step allows your domain to populate within the high-level platform. Before proceeding, it's crucial to create a backup of your website. This precaution allows you to revert to your original website in case anything goes wrong during the migration. We recommend using the Updraft Plus plugin, which is both free and user-friendly. With just a few clicks, you can easily create a backup of your website. If you prefer using a different backup plugin, that's perfectly fine. However, we recommend Updraft plus Backup and Restore, which is a free and reliable option. With this plugin, you can easily create backups of your website. Simply access the settings and select your desired remote storage location. Once you have chosen the location, it will ask you to authenticate your identity. So you can click the Save Settings button to save all the changes. Once you have done the settings, you can come back to the Backup and Restore menu, and from here you can click on the Backup Now button, and it will take the backup of your website within a few minutes based on the size of your website. Once the backup is done, you can check it in the existing backup section. We have already taken this backup of our website, and it is stored in Google Drive. Make sure you should take a backup of your website before moving to the next steps. After creating the backup, the next step is to export your current website from the WordPress platform. To do this, you can utilize the all-in-one migration plugin. Here's a step-by-step -step guide. Navigate to the plugin section of your WordPress site. Search for the all-in-one migration plugin. Install the plugin by clicking on Install Now, then activate it. In the left navigation panel, you'll now find the all-in-one WP migration option. Click on it and select the Export option. Click the green Export to button and choose to export it as a file. Once the export process is initiated, it will begin exporting your website. The duration of this process depends on the size of your website. Once it's completed, you'll be provided with the option to download the exported file. After downloading the file, you can close this export window. With the backup and website export completed, the next step is to return to the DNS settings. Here, you'll add DNS records to your domain name provider. Your domain name provider is where you purchase the domain for your website. We have purchased our domain from the Google domain, so we will log into the Google domains. From here, follow these steps. Log into your Google domains account. 
click on the Manage Settings option for the specific domain you intend to migrate. Navigate to the DNS section of your website settings. Start by adding the records. Click on the blue icon to copy the first field and paste it into the host name field. Set the type as TXT. Copy it. Paste it here. Create one new record and the second TXT record and now copy the second field. Paste it here. Choose the type as TXT and copy the second field into the corresponding space. Again add one new record. Copy it. Now choose the type and copy the second field. Once you have added the three records, you can click on the save button. It gives an error. It says you can leave this field empty. Save. Once you have saved the records in the domain name provider, you can come back to the high level and check this box. I have added the above records in my domain name provider's DNS settings. Click on Verify Records. It will detect your domain and it says your domain is detected. It means your domain is now populated in the high-level platform. Now you are left with the all-in-one step. You have to import the site that we have exported using the all-in-one migration plugin. Click on here. Choose the file that we have exported using the all-in-one migration plugin. Once the file is uploaded, you will get the option to request migration. Click on the Request Migration button and it will start migrating your website to the high-level platform. Once the migration is complete, you'll receive a confirmation message. Your website is now successfully migrated to the high-level platform. You can come back here and check it from here. You can click on this URL. It will take you to the main landing page of your website. From here, you can log into your WordPress dashboard of your website. And there you have it. You've learned how to swiftly migrate your website from an existing hosting provider to the high-level platform. If you found this video helpful, please like, share, and leave your comments below. Check out our website, globalsocialmediamarketing.com. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next video.